Okay, here goes. Make another short video, I guess. And, uh, well, what am I going to talk about? Uh, I'm going to say, teachers, uh, teachers, you're in the secular school, well, try and make it Christian as much as possible. If you're a Christian professor in a secular university, try and make it Christian as much as possible. Yeah, gee, get a haircut. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, well, what... They're trying to get our children. Uh, just like in Russia a hundred years ago, my parents told me that communism wanted the children, brainwash them, and uh, get them into the state schools, state-run schools. And so, right at an early age, and yesterday, right here in Golden, I... I saw, I talked to this girl, a uh, younger girl, oh no, well I did, and uh, she told me that uh, in school, they're trying to teach them that uh, too many people, population, too much population, so we have to have GMO food, because that's the only way to feed the world. Well, I told her that was all wrong, a big lie from the pit of hell, and uh so we could probably have a hundred billion people on this planet and uh, and feed it with organic food, with no GMO food, with the kind of food I grew up with. And yeah, we don't need the seedless watermelon. People don't even know what I'm talking about when I say, where's your real watermelon when I walk into the store? Uh, so the kids growing up now won't even know that watermelon once upon a time had seeds, black seeds, and it tastes 10 times better and it's a lot healthier. I couldn't even get Canadian potatoes yesterday in the store in Golden there in what's the name? It's not the Sobeys, the other one. I couldn't believe it. Best Western or something, Western uh, something uh, family, I think. And uh, they had a California potatoes. So what's with Canada? Wake up, Canada. I'll start growing my own again and demanding that they have Canadian potatoes. Like even in Manitoba, you won't find made in Manitoba potatoes sometimes in the store. It's unbelievable. So this this madness uh, has to stop. It's all madness. So you teachers, don't be afraid to speak up and tell the kids the truth because the schools are uh, very po political right from kindergarten to uh, grade 22, uh, if you know what I mean. They're very political. Uh, brainwashing them. Go to RadioLiberty.com with Dr. Stan and... Let's let's be uh, disobedient, uh, not politically correct. So I guess we would be disobedient then. Yeah, civil disobedience. Rock the boat. It's time for Christians, for church people, to come alive and not be afraid of jail or, or being arrested or losing your job. Uh, God will give you another job, a better job. Start your own school up, private school. Start homeschooling, anything. Start growing your own food. Oh, they'll outlaw gardens, I guess. They'll stop raw milk. Oh, yeah, store milk is bad. Yeah, it kills you. It does. Oh, that's why they got it in the prisons like crazy. Just feeding it. Let them drink the milk. Kill the prisoners off. <laughs> oh, 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 boy. <laughs>